Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the Ruger PC9 carbine. This is the newer model with the free float aluminum M-Lock handguard. Very nice setup. I took it shooting already. It was fun. It was accurate. This gun reviews extremely well. A lot of people love it. It enjoys a fine reputation and they like the adaptability of it with using Ruger mags, the Security 9, mags the 17 round mag that comes with it in the case or glock mags each has an adapter makes it nice ruger offers everything you need to change it out and things like that it's a simple design but yet extremely effective let's get it on the table and we'll take a closer look the ruger pc9 is a fine carbine it offers a lot for the money the msrp is 729 but i'm seeing it between 530 and 540 dollars on average at your local gun store now in the case it comes with this setup right here this is an adapter for the ruger mags I already switched it out to the glock mags it also comes with a 17 round security 9 ruger magazine a couple more spacers to adjust your length of pull a M-lock rail that you could add on there, the lock, and three Allen wrenches that is all you'll need to change anything out or, or do what you want with it. Now, if we look at the stock, it is glass-filled nylon, which is consistent with Ruger handguns and some of their rifles. Here are where the spacers can be added or taken away, and a rubber butt pad. Sling mount right here, nice texturing on the grip. And we'll see that, you know, we have some Picatinny rail space up here to add a dot if, if that's what you choose. It does come with an adjustable rear sight that is a ghost ring sight and a bladed front sight that is protected. But getting back over here, the, the charging handle comes on the right side, all right, but it can be switched over to the left side, making it ambidextrous. As where the magazine release is on the left side and that can be switched over to the right side once again making it ambidextrous now i already mentioned that i replaced the ruger adapter to the glock adapter and that allows me to use a glock magazine this is a glock 19 mag 15 round but of course the advantage here are these 33 round mags that glock offers so that that's a pretty nice way to go the trigger, I measure right under 5 pounds, all right? Here we have an unloaded carbine. I'm measuring it right under 5 pounds, standard rifle trigger pull. And then that was copied from the Ruger 1022. So I think, you know, Ruger had such a fine reputation with some of their firearms that they don't reinvent the wheel. They say, you know what, that works well on that rifle. Let's move it to the PC9 carbine. And that's what they did. Cross bolt safety right here. And then here's the handguard I was telling you about. All right, it's a, an aluminum M-Lock free float handguard, which is nice. And both sights are on there, come standard like that. And then the, the 16, a little over a 16 inch barrel that is threaded, one half inch by 28 threads and fluted. I don't know if the camera will pick that up, but the barrel itself is fluted. To swap out the magazine adapter, all you have to do is take the large Allen wrench from the case and loosen up this bolt and this bolt. Okay, the bolts remain in the lower receiver. And then remove the upper receiver. And then you just take it out. You push the magazine release, take it out, and you put the other one in. So easy, it really is unbelievable. You can get it done in less than five minutes. One of the greatest advantages is taking this down, I'm going to switch it around over here, is disassembling this. Now the first thing you need to do is lock the bolt back, so you pull it back, and then this lever here, you just, well let me see if I can do that again, and you push that in, and that will lock the bolt back. From there, all you have to do, this lever here, turn, and then pull off. So basically I, I move this up, that piece up, and then just turn. Now here we have right there all right comes off for easy cleaning bolt remains locked back and here is your barrel and handguard all right 16 i think 16.1 inch barrel is what it is and then you just put it back together move it like that just like that it's back together 
very nice setup you know at the range it performed just as i thought now if you love the ruger 1022 you're gonna love this carbine you know it's a nine millimeter it's uh, not an expensive round but the, the advantage with nine millimeter is that there are so many variations of nine millimeter that's the reason for its popularity you know it's the the grainage is higher you know it's it's made its way to the 40 smith and wesson while still adding many rounds in the magazine and and people have liked that and when you think about that with this carbine here and everything that it offers and everything that can be done to this it's just such a fine setup and people are loving it it's it's easy to use it's fun to use it's easy to clean it has a lot to offer and i think that the synthetic aluminum free float m-lock handguard really sets this one off i think the original is fine but i really like the way this one looks and performs so there it is ruger pc9 carbine with the free float aluminum m-lock handguard a nice setup I think Ruger did a great job with it. I feel like it's priced right. It offers a lot. And, you know, if you love 9mm shooting, you're going to love the PC9 made by Ruger. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching. And you guys be safe.